filled Saturday. Well, not filled, but like... <laughs> just did it again. What? <laughs> Whenever like, hi, and then you don't even like say a real sentence. You just be like, going to lunch. Erin <laughs> <laughs> filled Saturday. <laughs> I don't know why it always cracks me up. I think it's so cute. Um, we've had ourselves a morning. We slept in, read a book, Brian did some cardio. My aunts came over. Um, we got rid of some trash because we have to show you guys our countertop remodel has begun and we'll the just show you. Has, the bar has been lowered. Not like out of our standards, our like standard. <laughs> genuinely the bar has been lowered um, and we'll show you what that looks like. So we had to get rid of all the countertop and drywall from that. Yeah, it's looking already so like transformed I feel like, so if you can hear the rain. Yeah, it all of a sudden, like it wasn't supposed to rain today, but it's been raining for the last like two hours. Um, kind of sucks. Yeah, not my favorite. I wanted to go to the driving range. Well, sometime this weekend, but I thought maybe today. Today is not the day. No. Maybe tomorrow. Our living kitchen area is already so much more open by removing the bar top and lowering it down. So we will have like one level, like island kind of thing with the sink attached um, for our kitchen. Very like very excited it's gonna look really cool I think um, but we'll show you that when we get home we have to run some errands because I have some holes in my tennis shoes and um, we go to the gym only like five times a week work out maybe six times a week that yeah. I think it might be time to and you've had them for like five years now? I don't even know I don't even know I feel like I lose track of how long I've had those things that I generally wear shoes like that until like they just don't work anymore you and got they, them in college they work just fine but like, yeah, I mean like, you can see my socks through them. Like I try to wear black socks to the gym so you can't tell as much, but it'd really be good. We gotta run to the co-op and Ulta, just a few little errands and then we're gonna come home and just enjoy the weekend together. Yeah, we're gonna try to work on our registry a little more. Yes, we'll show you guys what we're asking for too, if you guys are curious. My toes. Oh yeah, you're you're there. You're at the you're at the yeah. tip. You're at the tip. <laughs> what do you think? I like the white better. Me too. We have ran a few of our errands now. Um, we uh, found myself some tennis shoes, which is very nice because um, I really needed some new ones. But I'm having this cookies and cream, like protein bar from Trader Joe's. The other version of this one that we got, your parents put it in our stocking. Yeah, it was really good. Such a good protein bar when I saw cookies and cream and I'm like, that does sound very tasty. And I'm getting hungry and I don't want to eat out, so. Mmm. Hey, baby. I like that. These have to be filled with like so much crap because they're so good. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm super stoked because it's time to show you guys the renovation process so far. All right, drum roll please. You guys ready? Bam. Look at that. The bar top is gone. We actually have a guy coming out later today to either do this, move this pipe down, because we'll explain that. He's gonna come either do it or give us a quote, but we need to be here for him to come and do that. I'm hoping it is not an expensive fix. I'm showing them. Oh yeah, now we have to, where are someone, did you already tell me about yeah. now? Yeah, so um, let me kind of explain what we're doing here if you're new. 
but as you can see we used to have like a raised bar um, they're pretty like common I would say like in 80s 90s early 2000s builds yeah. I don't really feel like they do them as often as m anymore or they do them like attached to islands um, but we really wanted it down so then we can we have a new countertop which is like a dolomite which is similar to a granite that we'll put here and it'll extend out all on one level so we'll get some new bar stools for this um when we the guy came out friday and he yeah probably right about there that's probably good right here like a like whole another, maybe like, foot maybe like a foot from here yeah foot i would say so it'll go all the way yeah yeah so maybe. as he was doing it he was like there's piping in the bar top which someone had actually mentioned to us so that's really the only obstacle we have at this moment. Um, I feel like renovations though, stuff does pop up. Um, we have a family friend who is an electrician going to reroute this guy to down here. Also, um, Todd, the guy that, I will also put Todd's information too, the guy that cut all this down, he's a handyman in the area. Um, he said that he sh like we should also ask AJ if he can do multiple off of it. Like, so we can have more outlets. And he's like, you could. Cut holes in the wall and yeah, and he also said that he was like, you can also do like um, extra ones, like with the USB ports plugged in. He was like, they're really nice to have around your bar top. So I was gonna talk to AJ about it and see what the cost could be for that. But, because he says that there's not, you don't need a ton of power from these boxes for small plugins like that, like because you're just plugging in like a phone. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so we have someone coming out Monday for the um, electricity. Um, we'll figure this out whenever we can get this done. We'll see after the quote. And then this garbage disposal will be a push button on our sink. We're getting a new sink, a new faucet. I think I said, Ryan said I said sink head, sink head yeah. in one of the vlogs. I didn't even notice it. And then on Monday, they are coming out to template, which means that they're going to like take their own measurements. Um, I, they should be able to do like a digital mock-up, right? Of like our... Yeah, so they're going to take their own measurements and then that's when we're going to talk to them about like how far do we want this out? Like how, uh, like the type, like the certain type of like edging we want, whether it's I think maybe like, like a totally like rounded smooth edge or like maybe, like, like, maybe a, like, a, like a natural or like just a total like 90 degree at like... I say cheapest. Yeah, whatever's the cheapest, <laughs> so... Um, but yeah, so this is, yeah, it's, it's really crazy to just see it. If you've been around, you know what it used, wow, I just was shaking the camera. If you've been around, you know what it used to look like having like just this up higher. So it really blocked your view to the kitchen. This just like opens up the space so much already. Just having that knocked down that it gets me really excited to see what it'll look like when we have like these beautiful white granite counters. So yeah, I just wanted to give you guys like a little update. We are home from shopping. I got these new little Pumas because it was time for some new workout shoes. I really like them though. They were 40 bucks. I don't want to spend a lot because, I, oh, Dodger would like to smell them. He's a little tail. He's like, oh, I love workout shoes. What do you think? Do you like them, Dodge? Oh, he does. Oh, okay, let's get down. That's enough, thank you. Um, got those, I'm excited to have some white sneakers. I've never had white like gym shoes. And then I got more of this, what did Ryan call it in the Christmas video? Like oil stuff or water stuff for her face. Like <laughs> it's this ordinary product. I really like it, it's like $6. It's actually what I use to like wash up my face. It's like the washing is like that like um, stone tool that like you rub up on your face. And then I got this Tula under eye balm, balm, Dodger. Oh my God, he is losing his mind over all these new things. What? Oh, Dodger, okay, uh-uh, this is mine. This is not yours, thank you. But yeah, heard really good things about it. It was a little spendy, so I hope I enjoy it. I am probably gonna go change now into something comfy. We're gonna take the dog on a walk in a little bit, but right now we don't need to. Okay, the guy came by. We got a quote for this. Um, he said he could have done it today, but he wants to wait for the electrical to be done. So it's actually decently affordable for what we need done, which is good because home renovations can be very spendy. So he'll come out next week now. Thankfully he was able at least to give us a quote because like we've been just not sure. Yeah, it won't be that much. Yeah. We also poured ourselves some we don't know if it's Zevia or Zevia. I always said Stevia growing up for like the fake sugar, but Ryan always said Stevia, so I don't know. But we're pouring it in our wine glasses so we can do our ritual. But I just feel like we're having a drink. We just don't really want to drink this weekend, so I just know it'll make me feel kind of crappy on Sunday, and I just want to wake up feeling good. So we're gonna 
Take these on our walk, huh, bub? Come. Like a oh my one. gosh. Oh, I want to try it. I got grape. I love grape flavored things, so yeah. it should be good. And I got the root beer. We're trying to try them all at this point because we like them. Yeah. Here. That tastes like grape soda. Oh my god, you, that one's really good. There wasn't much left, so you can try good. Um, oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, I really like mine. Oh, that does taste like grape soda. That's good. Yeah. These actually, like, I'm, I don't know how they do it. I, I don't understand, which means that it's probably full of, honestly, like, lots of fake sugar. It says, doesn't it's naturally flavored? Yeah, I mean, there's nothing it's in it. naturally flavored, gluten-free, vegan. Uh, all it says is carbonated water, stevia leaf, leaf extract, natural flavor. Yeah, I don't really know how they make them taste so similar to, like, the crappy stuff, but... No. Also, sport in my new shoes for the walk. I like and them. And my new jacket, yeah. Um, Randy, Ryan's dad, got me this like bomber Green Bay jacket and I really like it. All right, let's go on a walk. Let's stop teasing the dog. Okay, we made a little setup of lots really it's just dips <laughs> so this is the crab dip this is smoked salmon dip that is bitch and sauce which you have to have if you haven't we also got this helga's gourmet mustard yesterday so good and then kakana is a staple in this house and dots pretzels they're a must we are actually going to sit down and make our registry now um or at least like try to make a lot of headway on it is that the word headway i don't know yeah here we go okay i'm taking you guys into the office it's honestly just not put together at all right now but I'm gonna show you guys what we put on our registry here we go I know people like like registry ideas but we did some like power tools that we need lots of camping stuff that we borrow from the pipers that we could get for ourselves new plates and dishware because um, we've been using my parents old stuff and it's totally fine but it would be nice to have our own new silverware just lots of kitchen stuff we really would like some new nice sheets pots we put a little fun gift on here of the switch i ask for one all the time from ryan not ask i just like talk about how i want one so we're like we'll throw it on there new toaster and then some like honeymoon and like home renovation funds talked about it a little bit on my instagram but like it just feels weird with registry sometimes but it was actually very difficult to figure out what we wanted but i think we did a good job and then we looked at like some potential suits for ryan for the wedding so more info on that to come. Beautiful lighting in this bitch. Um, we are gonna make some lobster rolls, but. First attempt. Gonna try it out. They are a poor man's lobster roll though, because Ryan and I cannot, in our right minds, afford. <laughs> no, well we can, we just, I don't know, I don't wanna screw these up with like nice lobster. Yeah, I don't <laughs> like, know. It's also like, they're gonna be covered in like, mayo and butter and yeah i don't know i'm sure that's gonna be just fine but of course we are gonna look up a tiktok recipe i think we have pretty much look at the one that we picked out i think is pretty simple but we've got, oof, don't get jealous guys ugh, this kind of looks sick this oh way but God. well we honestly didn't have a choice because um online there was like lots of options like you could do different types of lobster rolls with like these different types of like canned lobster and all this stuff like yeah we didn't we don't have those at our stores or at least the few that we went to so mayo on the bun mayo on the bun don't be so stiff like <laughs> what is wrong with it eat it eat one can you eat it like this yeah Tastes just fine. Does it taste like lobster? Sorta. <laughs> Sorta. Kinda of tastes like the same as the imitation crab. Imitation crab, crab yeah. Have it! No, I, I literally can't eat it just like that. I like cannot. <laughs> You're not gonna like this. I'm gonna love it, I'm so excited! I used to eat the imitation crab in college. That's sick. Not, That's not by itself. By itself? You, no, you, you didn't eat it by yourself? No. 
No, I didn't. I did eat it by myself, <laughs> but not by itself. Oh. Yeah, I just get really depressed and just eat cold imitation crab by myself like a loser. Um, we might be losers though, just looking at this losery meal we're having. Should have too lobster tails to make that. I know. We actually. That's the thing is that. Okay, so these were. The th uh, I, we're so stupid, honestly, because we could have just got lobster tails, but they were $7.99 a tail, which felt like a lot. But now as we go to make them, I don't think there's price on tasty food. I think they're going to be just fine. Like Once they're all together, we do need to like melt butter and do that shebang. These ones have avocado on it too, which I liked that. I thought that was kind of fun. Okay, I need to watch the video. I'm making a mistake. This is why we go out to eat. I think you know what'd be good in this? Some Old Bay. Probably. Need some seasonings. Anything to cover the thickness. Yeah. Do we have to heat it up? No. Do you eat it cold? That's what it says. Why do you think this was a warm sandwich? <laughs> I don't know. That looks gross. <laughs> we probably have. We messed up. We messed up bad. I think this might be a more of a rich man's meal. Um, because no, we should have just bought the lobster tail. Um, we're in the middle of cooking it. We will come back soon. It looks so gross. It looks worse in this than it did just by itself. I know. I think it's the mayo. <laughs> It tastes fine. Okay, okay. Yeah. It tastes okay? Yeah. What What do you mean by fine? Like, is it... I mean, you try it. I, I literally can't. Yeah, I'm so... <laughs> like, I'm sorry. I guess I'm also like... I thought it was hot. Like, I thought it was hot lobster. Like... Yeah. I, like, I, thought, I thought the whole mixture was, like, warmed up. Mm -hmm. So I wasn't expecting, like, cold Oh, sandwich. we have a little extra mixture if, like, you want to put a little extra on. Okay, I think the butter is going to be essential here because. Okay. This looks like we're living on a budget. We are. It's it's not supposed to be like super glam. Do you want to show yours? Sure. To the, to the fans. <laughs> Yum. Yum. Let's see. It's a terrible idea. It's like, ooh, yum. Lobster rolls. Wait, it tastes fine. Like, My stomach has like a pit though. It actually, it's fine. Okay. All together, it's fine. Fine is not the words I no. want. Oh, good. I just took a bite of just all of that. <laughs> what I said My expectations were like ridiculously low. Mm -hmm. Rose, it's all over your brain. <laughs> <laughs> it's a butter. <laughs> Glad you can clean that. What? <laughs> okay, looks like we're gonna be making a pizza. I can make a pizza. What pizza? No, no, not in your napkin. In the sink. In the sink. Are you kidding me? You're a child. So Maybe we'll try again next weekend with real lobster. Oh my god. It's not, it's not spit it in your napkin, Dad. Oh, I don't like that. Okay. Everything about it was like... Let's make, we have all the ingredients, so let's maybe make it again next week in the real lobster. Yeah, I, I literally think just the fact that it's not real lobster. Like, I'm not a big... I should have known I'm not a big imitation crab person either. But I just thought like all together with like... The toppings... It would be okay. What would you like to do then for dinner? I don't know why I'm so 
Michael Eden. I don't know. You were fucking going to. <laughs> Not bad altogether. Oh, I see. I, the the texture of it. Throw that other pack in the trash then. You won't eat it. We should take it out to the real trash. Okay. Probably this too. Same with that. Yeah. Let's just put it in like a grocery bag, like a dog bag. I really like. I didn't have high expectations either. <laughs> what are we gonna eat then? We have a pizza outside. We can do pizza. I'm st still not super hungry. That was. Uh, over it. <laughs> um, definitely, if you guys are going to make lobster rolls, I don't know if this is the meal to skimp um, on your ingredients. Quality ingredients do have a great payoff. Um, I'm so sorry. It was my idea, and it was not, not good. Okay. Thanks for sticking with us for that one. Um, we are going to watch a movie now. I'm really not trying to be dramatic, but like that did make me nauseous. <clears throat> so I'm like letting my stomach. Uh, yeah, it kind of made you lose your appetite. Yeah, I like really mm -hmm. lost. I wasn't like starving before we even made the food, but like that really made me feel really icky. So um, we're going to chill for a little bit. We are going to watch the trial of the Chicago 7, right? Right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, and yeah, I just poured myself a New York seltzer if you guys have not had these they're like there's like 30 calories i think because there's is still it, sugar in is them. it 30 calories or 30 grams of sugar oh i don't think it's 30 grams of sugar oh but they are like a soda but they're like seltzer sodas i don't know but this is the vanilla cream soda one and i have it out of my wine glass because it's saturday night baby <laughs> <laughs> ryan got a diet mountain dew and yeah i kind of want to try it i haven't had a mountain dew in forever Okay, guess what my favorite Mountain Dew is? I'll let you guess. Did you guys guess? <laughs> Voltage. Oh, that stuff is so good. I always think like, really feels like battery acid when you like have Voltage and like sour candy. Mm, it's a lot. It's a lot. Oh my God, soda is so good. Diet Mountain Dew, like the Diet Mountain Dew and like the Diet Dr. Pepper, like. Pretty good. Yeah. And like, if you have them every once in a while, it's still not bad. It's not bad. And it's diet. Yeah. It's only uh, 10 calories. I mean, we're not binge drinking 10 drinks tonight, so I mean. Yeah. Yeah. And you know, we're not eating dinner. <laughs> yeah, we're not eating dinner either. Diets. <laughs> just kidding. And that's don't. on health. We don't diet in this house. Um, yeah, we just make shitty food and then stuff ourselves. <laughs> Lily, we told my brother and Amanda, and he was like, I'm dying over the fact that you guys got $2 lobster. I'm like, I, I don't know what we thought. Um, we have a wedding coming up. Yeah. I don't know what we were thinking. I'm actually so mad. Um, okay. Ooh, you guys want to watch? This is really where the vibes come in. 10 out of 10 recommend getting some like lights that you can change from your phone. And this is always the vibe. A nice purpley light to watch a movie, it just, I don't know, it makes us like not be as distracted either. All right, cheers, bruv. <laughs> I have been a garbage disposal for all things sweet tonight, so that's been great. I'm officially tired, Rai. Really? really? Yeah, are you tired? Yeah. Music to my ears. Um, we watched The Trial of the Chicago 7 and both really enjoyed it. And then we just watched another episode of Succession. Yeah, we're gonna head to bed. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I feel like this was a lot of fun information about our wedding and the countertops and making literally the most vile dinner. Make it better tomorrow. Yeah, we should also, I was thinking we could also check Costco for seafood. Okay. Sometimes they have like at least decent prices for what you get. Yeah. All right, if you enjoyed this, make sure to like and subscribe, and we will see you guys next time. Bye.